Yo, what's up everyone, Ufo here, and today, as you guys can probably tell from the title, we have got this clan chest tier 10 and ready to open. And on top of that, we've got this 12 win grand challenge chest to open. Also, for you guys that do not know, there's this new game mode out, Draft 2v2 Battles, and I want to kind of showcase it. So yeah, we've got a bunch of awesome stuff today. Hopefully you guys enjoy this video. If you do, make sure you guys leave a like. And if you guys could also subscribe, that would be awesome. And yeah, without any further delay, let's hop right into these chests. So first we're going to start off with silver chests. Only because we want to test our luck, you know, test the waters before we dive into the pool. We're really not expecting to get anything here. Ooh, okay, chest luck. Thank you guys for hitting the like button. Alright guys, next up we've got this clan chest. This thing contains 2 epic cards, 20 sand rares. After this we're going to open up this grand challenge chest which contains 11 epic cards and 110 rares. So good. So first and first clan chest, boom. Let's open it up here. We get gold to begin with, that's okay. Then we get 2 musketeers, 2, 3 musketeers, that's weird. Then we get some wizards fireballs and i think we can already tell that this isn't going to be a legendary unless we get a lot of epic cards oh ruined expos that's such a terrible chest anyway now we'll go hop into this grand challenge chest obviously 12 wins i might do a different video on the deck i used it's really powerful and yeah obviously it got me 12 wins so let's open it up here 11 epic cards 110 rares boom we open it up we're hoping so badly for a legendary please we start off by seeing some rares that's good some fire spirits that's okay okay so yeah next up we get elixir collectors oh we see one epic card early we're still looking for another 10 okay musketeers mega minions they're okay okay barbs elite barbarians again man every grand challenge chest i get i get elite barbarians musketeers archers that's a lot of archers give me some rares okay now that's all the comments just give me like the epic card oh my it's actually like so bad this is not worth 12 wins i was expecting a legendary what is my chest lock okay guys so i did a grand challenge just for fun you can see i went out in the 10th round here but one card left and it's flashing multiple colors this means we got a legendary for you guys that don't know in the new update they made it so when you're about to get a legendary this starts to happen and yeah looks pretty awesome we're going to see the new animation as well which is amazing and yeah in my comment section right now guys guess the legendary card it's a fun game we like to play no one cheat i'm going to guess electro wizard let's see what we get here so get ready to see the coolest animation ever boom and it's a bro the suspense boom graveyard hey i'll take that um for the rest of the chest that there it is and amazingly i got something better out of the 10 win one than i did the 12 win go figure i'm gonna hop into a 2v2 draft just to show this off it's honestly such an awesome mode and i really hope they bring it out in a challenge and like you can invite your friends to do it or something okay so we're into a 2v2 here you guys can see this is what it looks like i'm gonna let my partner pick his cards first and you can see it when he picks a card i can see what he picked and what he gave my Opponent. so yeah i'm just gonna let him pick all his cards to begin with then i'm gonna pick my cards based around his deck right now it's looking like he's going with a lava hound combo we're definitely gonna pick rocket now because he just gave them an expo i think we're gonna go with archers as well give them double princesses oh we can do lava loon this is gonna be great lava loon freeze or lava loon minor i think freeze okay let's do this we also got a giant a prince a witch what a weird hand we got graveyard i don't normally like the graveyard i normally consider the graveyard a pretty bad card in all honesty with you in 2v2s in normal it's really overpowered and broken but in 2v2s it's just not as good Ooh, great mortar man Locks straight onto that princess. Here, I guess archers. I don't know, man. This is awkward. We got two minion hordes. That's a really offensive rocket. Here, we're gonna go with a giant. Let's go with a lava. Um, not a lava hound. A minion horde. And then, please, dude, please take out that executioner. No, he just sliced and diced all my minions. He's so low on health as well. Just one hit. One hit. One hit. There we go. Here freeze that's perfect that's awesome so we just took the tower that was a really aggressive push like i don't think they were expecting that and yeah they have a lot of elixir now to do stuff with so help i think they're going to take our tower here that's fine we still have the secret weapon of the lava hound do not lightning that dude you really have like nothing here that's a good lightning now there you go he just cleaned up all that archers to take out that miner and i'm going to start a giant at the back just because i'm getting close to full elixir 60 seconds left of the game we're into double elixir time we're looking very solid dude play the lava hound i got the balloon ready wow they actually got lava loon as well and they just rocketed our tower to take it okay so this game might actually go into overtime oh executioner no thank you actually i should just rocket it i missed the tower 
I'm an idiot. But hey, we managed to kill the Executioner. Balloon is going to get onto the tower, it looks like. That minion horde on defense is doing so much work. Our Balloon takes the tower. We play a graveyard. We're just going really aggressive right now. Okay, yeah, I think this is a good game. Just one of them things where he really cannot stop this. And we got a million minions on the tower. Yeah, that's a good game. Wow, what a deck. And that's why 2v2 draft is so much fun. Okay, so we're into another one. This time, I got a different teammate. And yeah, hopefully we can win again. I'm going to pick Dark Goblin. That's just always my first choice. Now, like I said, I don't rate the Graveyard at all. I think it's a pretty bad card. And on top of that, the way how my teammate just drafted, it doesn't look like it's going to be very strong for us. So we're just going to take the Golem. Next up, we're going to take this Lava Hound. So we're getting a bunch of tanks. And then finally, I think Lumberjack. And hope they don't Graveyard Mirror us or something dumb like that. Ooh, we got Hog Riders. Yeah, we got good stuff. Okay, we should be okay. Here, we're just going to play a Lava Hound in the back. Ooh, that's going to be a good Lightning. Do it, dude. Yeah, it's nice. That's going to take out the Wizard. That's actually awesome. Hopefully, the Ice Wizard can take out these Arches. So close. That's unfortunate. Anyway, we've got a Mini Pekka for it. So it's going to be okay. Run away, Lumberjack. Ooh, run away, Hog Rider. Run away. Ah! Mini Pekka died, that's unfortunate. But hey, our Lava Hound made it to the tower. Our Lumberjack's going ham over there as well. It's kind of chaotic, not gonna lie. Don't know what's going on really. Ooh, that's a good fireball. Ooh, that's a lot of value for that fireball. Here we're just gonna play a knight. And what looks like a very deadly push just got shut down by one fireball. And yeah, that was really good play by my teammate. Okay, next up, there's some archers coming towards us. I'm not going to do anything. Yeah, he's not going to do anything either. We both have Golem Lava Hounds. What is this? Yo, man, let's just go double golems. They're going to be so confused. Like, this is already a 16 elixir push. He played a giant skeleton. I don't really think that's going to do a lot. Oh, we got Inferno Tower. Let's go. Here, I'm going to play a mini P.E.K.K.A. That's just more to stop the battle ram. And then poison all that. That should be good. We still got a golem like alive. And then we got some golemites. Do not knock that wizard out of the poison. Thank you. The second golem went down. That wizard as well survived on just a sliver of health. That's really annoying. Anyway, here they played the graveyard. And we just are spamming stuff down. We do not want them to get this tower at all. Please, man. Please defend. Defend better. Oh, there we go. We actually got everything. I think the lumberjack rage actually helped out quite a lot. Anyway, here. Just go use some arches to take out that princess next up he played a lava hound i'm just gonna play my own golem that's just gonna hold up everything pretty much and that bomb is gonna be deadly seven seconds after the game we lighten in the tower can we get there can we get there it's like so close no we're one poison away though so i think that's good game yeah, he's got a fireball. That's a good game. And yeah, again, really chaotic. I find it really funny how both me and my partner had lava hounds and golems. But yeah, that's just how draft works sometimes. So yeah, that's a really awesome fun game mode. I suggest you try it out with your clanmates if you haven't already. It's here all weekend. So yeah, you have this weekend to play it and then it's gone along with this normal 2v2 battles. So sad. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed this video. If you have, make sure you guys leave a like. Of course, subscribe if you haven't already. But yeah, make sure you guys take care, brush your hair, and peace out. Woo!